to meet Jason winning in victory lane. Now, before we get started, is this one number five or number six for this night machine? This is number five. This is number five. Number number six, maybe next time. Let I was gonna say that number six is next week. So five wins this season. We didn't we didn't think we were gonna see this car until the velocity. It's a surprise entrant tonight. Tell me the work that went into just getting this car back to the speedway. Yeah, these things take a lot of work, a lot of time to get them perfect, to get them right, to uh, compete with these guys. You gotta make sure everything's right on them, and we took a really hard hit there. Didn't have time to rush it, unfortunately. Don't like missing nights, but we had to, and uh, we came back as quick as we could. Uh, we love this stuff, man. It's fun. So we didn't want to miss another one. Luckily, we're back out here again. We made it worthwhile. <laughs> well, you made it count, my friend. You spent a lot of time at the front of the field. When Morrill slipped by, it was a pretty move from the number 11 car. I thought you were dead in the water. All of a sudden, on the restart, on the outside off of two, monster power move. Where in the world did that one come from? Yeah, you know what? If Morrill got me on my starts, he has me pinned now. I never want to start beside him anymore. But uh, <laughs> we, have, uh, we have some power steering issues right now. So things started getting a bit greasy. It was hard to kind of wheel around there. And... Uh, you know, no excuse, but we like the outside more there. Obviously, we get onto the throttle and, and it hooked up. Uh, that Speedy Auto Machine Motor uh, in Newmarket there, that was awesome. Uh, go see Matt at Speedy Auto. That just showed it in one, two right in the middle there. Pulled that car link, that's what we needed. Got into three, four first and uh, came out with the checker. It makes some steam, and I just gotta ask for, for just for record, the lap 16 restart, you washed up the racetrack in turn two and it looked as though you just couldn't get the car to turn. Moro backed way out of it to, to help you recover. I gotta think if that was half of the guys in the pit area, this 19 car might have been that outside retaining wall. What happened on the lap 16 restart? Yeah, that's when I realized I had something wrong. I was on the radio vibrating. I actually blew a, a line off the rack earlier tonight and I had something just patched together. Wasn't quite doing the job, uh, but that's when right away I knew I was in trouble and I was just thankful not to uh, take the whole field out there. But. Uh, Morrill Moro, was awesome to race with. Uh, he gave us room, and I was getting into him a bit. Uh, that wasn't intentional stuff. He knows that. We get along well. So uh, I, I was glad that nobody got wrecked, and it probably, hopefully it was a good race for the fans. That, uh, that was a good race for us, so I'm sure they liked it. Phenomenal run, my friend. Win number five. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise.